Hi there. In this JavaScript exercise video, we will create a JavaScript program, a JavaScript function that will find 1st January be a Sunday between a range of years. What exactly it means? It means today is 1st March 2022. Okay. And in 2022, January 1st was on Saturday. Let's say in 2023, January, it is on Sunday. So we will write a JavaScript program that will return these years which have 1st January on Sunday. Okay, let's start. For that, we need to create one function get years. Okay, and a function here. Let's call it out get years. Okay, here, first of all, you need to create a date okay for that new date for that you need to pass year okay here in the parameter you need to pass year and for example we are giving 2022 is the year we are passing okay the second argument will be a month right the month january starts from zero so it will be zero and the third argument is date so that is one let's console this so we can see the output as you can see saturday january 1st so on january 1st 2022 it was saturday let me change it to 2023 okay and january 1st is on sunday so this is the day the date which we are looking for 2023 is the year which we want in the return okay so here let me comment it out here what you can do you can find b dot get day and simply consolidate let's see what it returns it is a function of course so you need to check it is zero so for 2022 it is returning zero 2022 it is returning six so the condition will be like if p dot get day is equal to zero then you can console First January is being Sunday which year so you can pass out the year so let's use template literals okay and you can pass out year remove this you don't need this so in 2023 first january is being sunday 2023 let me change the year value 22 it will not console anything because this d dot get the get day function is returning six not zero okay so this is what we are looking for now this is for single year what if we want to give as an argument the number of years like 2000 for example 2000 to 2050 for example and we want to see how many year the first january is on sunday okay so year and end year let's say okay so here what we can do we can use one loop the for loop right so for variable year is and year present equal to end year right and year plus plus so this is a basic for loop Let's make it dynamic. Okay. Here we can pass out 
the year right 0 1 that is fine and that's all that's all we are looking for so these are the number of years which year has first january is on sunday 2006 12 17 23 34 40 and 45 okay let's add some styling so we can make it look better console.log here you can give some space or some strings whatever suits you okay so this looks good now so using this function right you can determine on which year the first day is sunday on the first january i hope it will helpful for your interview purpose somewhere and if not it will be good to know something basic and useful that's all for this video if you are new please subscribe to my channel and give us a like thanks and see you next time